Hello and welcome to another statue review. This is going to be of a sideshow uh, Nathan Drake statue. Now, I just got this new in box. This is the non EX, but it took me forever to get this one. I'm trying to get the lighting a little better. It's actually very, very well done. Obviously, it's an action pose. The, the footprint of it's not terribly huge, but captures him pretty well. Got his watch. Detail in the boots. Um, a few things like right here. Let me see if I can get it. Paint sloppy. Here you can see it around the trigger and then here. Just a little bleeding. A little sloppiness, but it doesn't really take away from it too much. This is another one that was a pain in the ass with oh great, I just saw that. So this is there we go. My daughter likes touching it. I thought I might not put them together. But the, the bandolier, whatever it is, the belt. Kind of a pain in the ass to put on. Um, same as a scarf, you just kind of wrap it around his head. There's really no instructions on how to do it. Face is pretty good. Um, very accurate to the game. Surprised that they didn't make one for the fourth in the series. I think they made the one, but it's not quarter scale. Uh, the only difference from this and the EX would be, I believe, yeah, this, he's holding the the AK versus the pistol. Cloth pants. I mean, but you see, like the, the detail. They did do a pretty good job. Goes The boots go up quite far. Pants come down. Yeah, really cool, the, the laces and everything on the boot. But yeah, very well done. It's He's actually sitting next to uh, Lara Croft. A Gaming Heads statue that I'm actually going to be reviewing next. Um, I was pleasantly surprised with. A great job with this one. I like it a lot. Just has the character, everything, everything about him in the games. This is captured so well with this guy. I forget if this gun comes out or not. Yeah, just really cool. There is actually another piece. I want to say it's, it's like a necklace or something. I just have it in the bag, sitting by his base, because I, I don't know where it goes to be honest. So I'm not going to throw a necklace on him when he has this scarf, ascot, whatever you want to call it, around his neck. Yeah, very, very well done. Face is almost spot on. I wish there was more in this line, to be honest. There were a lot of cool characters in, in the games that you come across, and this is the only one that they ended up doing. But... Very cool statue. I don't like that people are trying to gouge on the EX version of him now that he's been sold out for a while. I pay, I literally picked him up in October of 2018 for $350. And I, I could have actually had the EX for 400 which I'm kind of regretting now just because I like the EXs. But but people asking like five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars $800 for this guy, it's just too much for him in my opinion. He's a cool character, but he just has the games. That's really it. So as always, any questions, comments, head down to the comments section, like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next review.